Hi friends, I am Sujoy and today I will tell you how to do Newton's backward difference interpolation on Casio FX nanonius calculator. So let's start. Our question is compute f of x or function of x for x equal to 21 from the following table. Before starting the tutorial, some question that might come in your mind that are first question. What is Newton backward difference formula? It's a formula used to find f of x or function of x for given values of x. Second question, when to use Newton backward formula? It's used when there is even gapping between each term of x. In our question, even gapping is 5, 0, 5, 10, 15, 20. And Newton backward formula is used when our required value x, x is below the middle element. Here 10 is the middle element since it has two numbers above it and two numbers below it. So when <coughs> x is below middle element, for example, x equal to 11, 13, 17, we we'll use Newton backward formula. And if x is above middle element, for example, x8, x7, we will use Newton forward interpolation formula. I have uploaded another video covering Newton forward interpolation formula. Please watch that video that will strengthen your concepts. Now, <coughs> to find the solution, we have to construct the backward difference table. This is the backward difference table. And since our desired value x is at the bottom of table, we will use Newton backward formula. To make this table, make the structure column wise and write x y equal to f of x both are same this symbol is called napla it is inverse of del so napla y n napla square of n napla cube y n and napla 4 y n and write all the x values column wise all the y values column wise the first element in the x column is called x0 second x1 x2 x3 Similarly, last element called xn. In y column, y0, y1, y2, y3 and last element yn. To construct this column, start from the bottom and this minus this, this, this minus this, this, this minus this, this, this minus this, this, same process, this minus this, this, this minus this, this, this minus this, this, this minus this, this and this minus this, this, this minus this, 0. One more thing, since our x is below 20 and our x, xn equals to 20 and yn equals to 15.4 we'll draw a line starting from yn to the last element if x would be 17 in that case our xn would be 15 and yn will be 8.2 and we'll draw a line covering these elements in that case 0 will not be needed next we have to find out p p equals to x minus xn x is 21 xn is the value above x in the table above x is 20 so xn equals to 20 <coughs> and h is the gap between each term of x so gap between each term of x in our question is 5 so p becomes 21 minus 20 by 5 equals to 0.2 and this is the newton backward interpolation formula general formula y equals to f of x equals to yn yn this p into del yn this line is drawn to pick the elements in the del yn column along the line is a del yn del square yn along the line is del square yn sorry napla napla yn napla square yn napla cube yn and napla over yn to memorize the formula simply memorize first two terms and to form this term p into p plus 1 by factorial 2 into napla square yn remember the this factorial value and this power value will be same and this value minus 1 will be the <coughs> added to the p for example in next question this is factorial 3 cube and 3 minus 1 2 will be p plus 2 similarly for fourth element it will be factorial 4 power 4 and 4 minus 1 3 p plus 3 Next, this is the formula, putting the values in the backward interpolation formula. This is yn, this is p into yn, uh, into napla yn, p into p plus 1 by factorial 2 into napla square yn, this is napla square yn, plus p into p plus 1 
plus p plus 2 divided by factorial 3 into na plus q by n and we will <coughs> write also p into p plus 1 p plus 2 p plus 3 divided by factorial 4 into na plus 4 by n is 0 so write this this into this this and to construct this formula use your calculator press the fraction button 0.2 I am writing this term 0.2 into 0.2 plus 1 divided by factorial of 2 press 2 and for factorial press shift and this button press joystick left into 2.8 press equals to that will give you value in fraction format to convert in decimal format press s 2 d button so it is 0 0.336 0 0.336 to compute this remember this structure is same up to this point but factorial value will change and one will one more term adding this plus uh, 1 plus 1 2 will be added and the value of <coughs> Nabla Q Y N. Again, use your calculator. This is 0 0.6. Press del to delete. 0 0.6. Press del. Factorial of 3. Add one term. 0 0.2 plus 2. And press equals to. It will give you 0 0.0528. 0 0.0528 and <coughs> this is, is 0 Napla 4 y n so we won't multiply this 0 into anything is 0 so adding up all these values you will get the, our answer 17.2288 so you can try yourself another question for x equals to 17 f of x will be 10.7104 and for x equals to 17 our xn will be 15, yn will be 8.2 8 and uh, napla yn will be 4.4, napla square yn will be 2.2 and napla cube yn will be 0 0.6 drawing this line and napla 4 yn equal to 0, no needed. So friends this was my tutorial, if you like the video please like it and subscribe to my youtube channel that would encourage me to upload more quality videos next time. Additionally, if you subscribe, you will be notified by an email whenever I upload a new video on my channel. I have uploaded many videos on <coughs> a complete series of tutorials on this calculator and videos on tutorials of this calculator also. Also many more videos about mathematics and engineering mathematics, <coughs> some engineering formulas and computer science videos. If you want to watch that, please visit my channel at youtube.com front slash sujoy n70 you can also follow my blog at www.sujoy-tech.blogspot.com there i regularly post articles on mobile and computer technology don't forget to like and subscribe so for now i am signing off thanks for watching